Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hello. Thank you for clicking on this video. My name is Madison or Maddie. You may call me either. I go by both. Today's video is going to be about the one and only makeup sale that I actually get like super amped for. I feel like when people do sales, like, you know, like 20% off here, 30% off here, that's really exciting. And I get the, the butterflies inside of me but this sale, you already know what sale it is by the title, but this sale, <laughs> something about it just gets me really horny and I just love this sale so much. This video is going to be all about my recommendations and my thoughts on the Spring Ulta 21 Days of Beauty. I honestly get so amped for this sale. I don't know what it is. I think I said it in my last recommendations video. I don't know if it's just, the longevity of it. I don't know if it's just the different products on each day or what it is, but I just think this is probably one of the best things that Ulta does besides their rewards program. I think Ulta has hands down the best rewards program and this sale is pure genius. If you're on Ulta's mailing list, then you probably already got a little sneaky peeky at the days. So I filmed this last year. Ulta does do this sale twice a year. If you are unfamiliar, I'm gonna go ahead and give you the little dish on it. So Ulta Beauty is a makeup store if you're living under a rock and you don't know what Ulta Beauty is. They do a makeup sale twice a year in the spring and in the fall. It is 21 days. This is the spring edition. It will start March 17th and then it will end on April 6th. And throughout the 21 days, there are different products on sale. There are a list of products that are on sale the whole 21 days. I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys the full rundown, show you everything. I'm gonna put the calendars on the screen. I will also link them down below. So if you guys just want to physically see them or kind of keep track with it, I understand. You need to be smart about this, okay? You need to go in here with a plan. You need to go in here with what you're gonna buy so you don't go broke, which will probably happen to me anyways. So I have done it the past two times that Ulta has had their sale. So I just give you guys my thoughts, what I'm gonna be picking up, maybe what I think you guys should pick up, and just kind of an overall look at the 21 days and also their hot buys. So their hot buys are the items that are on sale the entire 21 days. Other than that, they do have specific products on specific days. Let's just go ahead and dive in because this is a good one. I'm actually going to be looking at it on my phone because I don't know what Ulta's reasoning or message behind it is, but some items are not included in the magazine release. They do have more items on the actual app. So what I want to talk about first. Oh, before we get into it, I mean, you're here, you're watching, you're enjoying, you're eating your snacks, sipping on your drink. You might as well hit that subscribe button so you can see in the end what I actually pick up. I feel like I'm really close to the camera. Hit the subscribe button, turn on your notifications so you don't miss it. Also give me a thumbs up because you're just feeling generous. The very first day that I wanna talk about is the very first day, Sunday, March 17th. One item that I recommend you guys picking up is going to be the Tarte's Lights Camera Lashes 4-in-1 Mascara. It is regular 23 and it will be on sale for $11. I don't know if I'm gonna be picking this up just because a lot of times I wear false eyelashes, so it's not like a huge deal what mascara I use underneath, you know? Like I'm good with my cover girl. If you're not a false eyelash girl, then this mascara is really bomb. I like the wand. It gives a nice voluminous look. It does add a little bit of length. I just feel like it kind of does that all in one mascara. The formula is really nice. It doesn't smudge for me. I didn't have any issues with it flaking. It is a really good mascara. Moving right along. I'm going to go ahead and go into the next day, which is going to be Monday, March 18th. So one thing that I recommend for you guys to pick up is the Dose of Colors Desi and Katie friendcation palette. Number one, when I saw this, my jaw dropped. I really enjoy this palette. Dose of Colors is one of my top favorite makeup brands all around. It is such a beautiful palette. It does have those neutrals. It does give you those pops of that green and blue and that like midnight black with the shimmer in it. I just think it's such a beautiful palette. It is regularly $55 and it's gonna be on sale for $27.50. So I definitely think that's a good steal and I definitely think it's worth it. One item that I'm gonna be picking up that day is going to be the Smashbox Cali Contour 
palette. I have been eyeing this palette for some reason. I just think it's so pretty. I've been really wanting to adventure out and find more contour and bronzer shades. So that is going to be on sale for $19.50 and it is regularly $39. I'm telling you guys, I'm gonna get in trouble with these back-to-back -back days. So then we're gonna move right into Tuesday, March 19th. They have on sale the Derma Blend. These are the Flawless Creator Multi-Use Liquid Foundation Drops. I have heard Manny MUA, another makeup artist that I follow on Instagram, and a couple more people rave about these drops just for the sense of making a foundation more full coverage or adjusting your shade. I am really intrigued about these and I want to try it out for myself and also possibly get some from my kit just because I do have those brides or bridesmaids that want a more like natural kind of sheared out foundation or I do get those bridesmaids as well that want that very full coverage glam. So I definitely think this would help to put in my kit and also just give me the regular nearly $40 and they're going to be on sale for 20 so definitely a really good sale. Moving on to Wednesday, March 20th. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for this. They are going to be having the MAC Pro Longwear Paint Pots on sale. If you are a true OG YouTube watcher, then you know how intense the MAC Paint Pots were here. Everybody and their mom was using them before people started using concealer or eyeshadow bases or anything else that is on the market now. In my four to five years of doing makeup outside of YouTube and Instagram, I have never tried them. Ugh. I was fine using any concealer that I had and just calling it a day, but they're going to be on sale for $11 when they're originally 22. So now you could get two for the price of one. And that is the kind of girl that I am. So I'm definitely gonna be picking up Painterly and Soft Ochre. I'm so excited. And I cannot wait to try these guys out. Thursday, March 21st, I just wanna hit on the Becca primers are going to be 50% off. Well, obviously everything is 50% off. So let me just calm it down there. But the Becca primers are gonna be on sale. They're normally 39 and they're going to be on sale for $19. The two that I highly recommend are going to be the backlight priming filter and then the first light priming filter. The backlight is one of my favorite primers. I use it on pretty much all of my brides, my bridesmaids, myself. It is such a good glowing kind of glow from within. It's not gonna do anything for your pores. It's not gonna do anything for your oils. It's not gonna do anything like that. But if you really like that glow from within or like that glow from underneath your foundation, then that is gonna be the primer for you. I may pick up the first light priming filter because I've only tried a sample of that and I actually did like it. It was kind of, I wanna say it kind of evens out the skin. It kind of just smooths it and get it gets it ready for application. The next day that I want to talk about, we are going to jump to Saturday, March 23rd. Put this in your books, ladies and gents, because Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz is on sale. You heard me correct. It is going to be on sale for $10.50 instead of $21. The Brow Wiz will change your brow game life. I will be picking up two in granite. So if you live near me, don't even pick up granite. Okay, let me have them. Monday, March 25th, they are going to have the Skin Iceland, I think I'm saying that right, Skin Iceland eye gels on sale. They're going to be $7.50 to $15 and they're normally $15 to $30. I think it depends on if you get a single pack or if you buy multiple packs. Those eye gels are really nice. They're the under eye gels to kind of smooth and depuff under your eyes. They're really nice if you put them in the fridge. So definitely recommend those. It's just a good eye patch. I feel like you can't really go wrong with those. They also do have the diamond and platinum exclusive that day, which is the MAC Fix Plus Spray. But these are the scented ones. So they do have coconut, rose, and lavender. I do have one. I think this is my last one. Last 21 Days of Beauty, they had the original Fix Plus on sale, and I ended up picking two up, of course. I'm probably gonna go ahead and pick up one of those. I don't know which one. I haven't smelled any of those. I would maybe pick up the coconut or lavender. I don't think I'm gonna pick up rose. I don't like flower smells. Tuesday, 
March 26th, the Nikki Tutorials Highlighting Trio with Ofer Cosmetics is going to be on sale. It is going to be $14.50 instead of the $29, so you get three highlighters. I love Ofer highlighters. They're probably top five in my book. They are so pretty. You can build them up. They're so blinding. They give that wet look on the skin. I just think that's a really good steal. You get three highlighters for $14.50 from Ofra, and that is unheard of. <laughs> Moving on, this is the day I think I'm going to spend the most money out of all of them. Normally, I only grab one or two items from each day, and this one... Ulta, you outdid yourself. Ulta must have hacked into my loves list and just gone from there because so many of the items that I've been wanting to try but just honestly haven't been wanting to splurge on are in the 21 Days of Beauty and I could not be more excited. Wednesday, March 27th, the Smashbox Photo Finish Primerizer is going to be on sale. I think I said that right. Primerizer, primerizer, primerizer? You know what I'm trying to say, okay? It is going to be on sale for $21 when it is normally 42. I've wanted to try this primer for so long, ever since they released it, but I just couldn't justify paying $42 for a primer. I kept putting it in my cart, I kept putting it on my loves list, and I just could never pull the trigger. So, March 27th, you bet your damn bottom, I'm gonna pull that trigger finally. Another item that I just wanna go ahead and shout out is the Persona Cali Glow Highlighters. I've been wanting to try these highlighters for the longest, okay. I've debated on getting these highlighters, I have just gone back and forth, and I'm going to be getting what is it? Uh, Zuma, I think is the highlighter. Yes, bitch. Zuma. That is an online buy. Some of these purchases are online only, so just make sure you guys check and you don't try to go into your Ulta. My bandana's falling, okay. And you don't try to go in your Ulta looking a little sketch, not seeing the product. That one is going to be online only, so it retails for $12. 12 dollars instead of 24. I'm gonna be snatching that up so quick. Had to do a little bit of a memory card change and also a lip touch up. We were getting a little crusty. The third and final item that I'm going to be picking up and most excited about is the Beauty Bakery HD Flower Setting Powders. They are originally $24 and they're going to be on sale for $12. They do have three shades, I believe, a translucent, a yellow powder, and then a deeper shade for deeper skin tones. I think it was Jackie Ina who raved about these powders and just talked about how sooky they were, how fine they were, and I just really want to try them. Dropping over to Thursday, March 28th, they are going to have the Buxom Full On Plumping Lip Creams on sale. They are normally $21 and they're going to be on sale for $10.50. These are one of my top three favorite lip glosses. Blushing Margaritas is like my lip shade, but just a glossy, juicy version. I wear Blushing Margaritas on my no makeup days when I just want a little juicy kind of lip action moment. It's so pretty. Hot Toddy, I think is another one that I wear all the time. They are a little bit minty, but they are not sticky. They're not tacky. They have so many good nude shades and just staples. So I'll probably pick up another Blushing Margaritas because that is holy grail, one of my tops. Moving on to Friday, March 29th. On line, they are going to have the Too Faced Born This Way Ethereal Loose Setting Powder. It is normally $33 and it's going to be on sale for $16.50. If you guys saw me trying new makeup, I'll go ahead and link it up here. I did end up trying this Too Faced powder and I have fallen in love with it. It is so smooth under the eyes. It just blurs and just gives you that effortless and awake look under the eyes. It's so stunning. Saturday, March 30th, they do have the Mario Badescu drying lotion on sale. It is normally $17 and it is going to be on sale for $8.50. I almost said $18.50. They do have a plastic bottle and also a glass bottle, which I think is a good, I don't know why more brands don't do that. I think that's such a good idea because you have more clumsy people who can't handle a glass bottle me. It is just that kind of spot, not concealing, but stop, spot treatment. If you have any acne or any blemishes that pop up, um, you can put it on and it is supposed to help minimize and just heal them a little bit quicker. I've had it before and really enjoyed it. I just never picked it up again. Another product that day that is going to be on sale, which I recently found interest in and wanted to purchase, and I'm low-key glad I haven't purchased it yet, is the Derma Blend Setting Powder. I want to pick up the Translucent translucent. I will be picking up the translucent. Oh my god. 
I will be picking up the translucent setting powder. It is normally $29, so it's gonna be on sale for $14.50. There's just something about trying different loose setting powders that I really enjoy. I don't know, I really like finding them, even though my Maybelline Fit Me is still to this day my number one holy grail. I haven't found anything to replace it. I've also heard this is really good to use on clients, so I may have to pick up an extra one for my kit. We're getting to the end. No, this is my least favorite part. On Monday, April 1st, they do have the diamond and platinum exclusive online. The Clinique Moisture Surge 72 hour auto replenishing moisturizer is going to be on sale for $19.50 when it is normally $39. I am going to be snagging this so fast. I just recently tried, it's right here on my desk. This is the mini version. I got this I think I got this in a Sephora perk or like with my Sephora reward points. I purchased this and have just fallen in love with it. It is so hydrating. I use it more so at night or when I just feel a little bit drier and it just kind of snaps my skin right back into place and gives me that moisture. So I would like to pick up a full size one. On Tuesday, April 2nd, the First Aid Beauty Facial Radiance Pads are going to be on sale from eight to $16 when they're normally 16 to 32. I am debating on picking these up. I haven't used like facial pads, I feel like since high school. It says it exfoliates, tones, brightens with gooseberry and lemon. So I would definitely enjoy that just to kind of help exfoliate and brighten my skin. Wednesday, April 3rd, they are going to be having the Cover FX Perfect Setting Powders on sale. I think they actually had these the last 21 days of beauty. They are normally $35 and they're going to be on sale for $17.50. You guys know that this was my holy grail powder before I got introduced to Maybelline and honestly, it just kind of got put on the back burner. But if you guys haven't tried it and you're looking for a really good setting powder, I would pick up this one or the Too Faced and it's gonna be on sale for $17.50. So it's definitely a good, a good one to get, you know? Two days left on April 5th, which is a Friday, the Too Faced bronzers are going to be on sale. These are, I think it varies. They have the, oh yeah, oh yeah. They have, I think all of their bronzers are gonna be on sale. So Chocolate Soleil, Milk Chocolate, Chocolate Gold, Sun Bunny, um, Tutti Frutti. They have the Sweetheart Bronzer. I will definitely be picking up some of those because like I mentioned earlier, I just really enjoy trying out new bronzers and just trying to find the one that really fits my skin tone and what I really enjoy. I've tried out the Chocolate Soleil bronzer before and it was a little bit dark. So I think I'm gonna go with the Milk Chocolate one. They are normally $30 and they're going to be on sale for 15. So definitely a good price. And Too Faced bronzers, I just feel like you can't really go wrong. And then the last 21 days of beauty on Saturday, April 6th. On sale, they are going to have the Benefit Gimme Proof Brow Gel. I'm actually really excited about this. I've tried a mini one. It wasn't in my color though. It was in number three and I'm definitely a five or six. So I'm going to be getting that. It is going to be $12 when it is normally 24. I definitely think it is a good brow gel to set your brows. I think it's also a good like everyday brow gel because not everybody's going to fill their brows in. And honestly, lately I have been going in with a colored or tinted brow gel and just really brushing my brows up and just kind of filling in the arch and calling it a day. So something like that is definitely what I would be reaching for at the moment. So I'm going to pick up that and probably, I think they only have like one, three and five. So I'm gonna be picking up number five. So that is everything for like the physical 21 days of beauty from March 17th to April 16th. Now I'm gonna go ahead and briefly touch on the hot buys. So the hot buys, like I mentioned earlier, are items that are on sale the entire 21 days of beauty. So a hot buy that's going on sale that you guys know, if you are a real subscriber of mine, if you have been here for a minute, if you've seen my other Ulta videos, you know I have raved about these in multiple videos. They are the Laura Geller Baked Blush and Brighten. I have four of them and I will probably get four more. Oh my God, so I think I'm only missing two and my collection will be complete. 
I got this recommendation from Katie. She raved about them one time and I think it was like a week later they were on sale for the 21 Days of Beauty. I picked them up and honestly have just fallen in love with them ever since. I wear them anytime that I really want that glowy blush sheen look. They're just so beautiful on the skin. They mix in with your bronzer and your highlighter and just give that overall kind of flushed, very healthy glow to the skin. Honestly, one of my top favorite makeup discoveries I've ever discovered. So they are normally $28 and they're going to be on sale for $16. I definitely recommend them. Pink Grapefruit and Honeysuckle, I believe, are the two that I use the most. I will be picking up some of the Dose of Colors Lip It Up Satin Lipsticks. They are normally $17 and they're going to be on sale for $10. Dose of Colors has my top favorite liquid lip formula. I think it is so beautiful. They glide on. I don't feel like I have dry lips when I wear them and I really want to try these satin lipsticks. I feel like so many people talked about them when they first hit the market and I missed my shot on that. So one item that's going to go on sale that I'm a little on the fence about, I feel like I need to dive into it a little bit more maybe, is the Flesh. They're the Firm Flesh Thick Stick or Touch Flesh highlighting balm. So I'm looking more so into, I think, the Firm Flesh Thick Stick. I want to do these for cream contour. I love a good cream contour, especially in the spring and summer. I think it just looks so beautiful underneath everything, putting a little bit of bronzer over top of it, and I just think you look so sun-kissed and golden and bronze and just a goddess. I mean, if it's the right tone, of course. Normally $18, and it's going to be on sale for $12, so I'm a little on the fence. I may pick it up. I just kind of wanted to mention it. I will probably pick up one of the Persona Matte Liquid Lipsticks. I feel like Samantha March and a couple other people rave about this formula. I haven't tried anything from Persona Cosmetics, so I feel like now is the time because things are going on sale, and I want to pick up maybe a nude or the red I've heard people talk about. They are normally $16, and they're going to be 30% off, so I'm probably going to be leaning towards picking up a shade or two of that. Skincare wise, the Bosha Luminizing Black Charcoal Mask is going to be on sale. It's normally $34, and it's going to be 30% off. I would highly recommend that. It is one of my all-time favorite peel-off masks. I have it in black and then the limited edition pink. I used it in a Instagram tutorial, so if you guys want to check it out, hop over to my Instagram and you can see it in action. It is so good for kind of just refreshing and reviving the skin. The hot buys I feel like aren't really hot this year, you know? One thing that I kind of just skipped over and I didn't realize that I skipped over it is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Blush Trios. Those are going to be on sale for $18 when they're normally $30. So you do obviously get a trio of blush colors. I have Peachy Love and it's really nice. I love all three colors. You can use them individually. You can mix them all together and Anastasia just does no wrong in my book. And with that guys, I am done giving you my recommendations and my thoughts on the 21 Days and Beauty Spring 2019 edition. I'm so excited about this. There are so many amazing products. I feel like sometimes it's a big guess if it's going to be good or not. I feel like last fall was a little iffy and I think that's why I didn't do a haul. I didn't grab as many products as I thought I would and this time I can already feel my bank account giving me that side eye like girl slow your roll. I really hope you enjoyed my recommendations. I hope they were helpful and I hope you guys have fun with this sale. I love doing these. I mean, if you don't love them, well, you made it to the end. Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you and I will see you in the next video.